Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Beauty For You with Danielle and today is a wig review. Yes, ladies, a wig review. I promised you guys that I would uh, try to push out those wig reviews. Um, and let's go ahead and get started. Um, today's wig is going to be by the Harlem 125 collection. It is a 100% human hair. Um, the name of the wig is Chloe EK and she's in a F1B30. I ordered this wig off of Hair Sisters. Uh, dot com for twenty dollars and forty nine cents and it had very very fast shipping um, I actually got this wig on last Wednesday and um, like I had mentioned earlier in one of my other videos that I am a little behind on my wig reviews ladies so please bear with me um, I just have have had a lot of things going on but I want to go ahead and um, get this out um, there's no picture on the tag but I wanted to try it out it's 100% human hair, like I said, and it's a short wig, and here she is right here. So we're going to go ahead and get started. I already got my wig cap on and everything like that. So, Oh, I'm sorry. There are no combs. Only has um, adjustable straps in the back. This is my first wig by the Harlem Collection. So, let's see. The way they had it styled on the model on Hair Sisters, it was very, very, very pretty. Um, and you know, it's about to be summer, and I really want to try to rock some shorter styles, you know, and change it up a bit so and as you all know I do not like hair in my face that is whew, very annoying very annoying so far it's okay I think it's all right uh, when I first took her out of the pack she had that cone head effect so uh, what I did Excuse me, ladies. I do apologize. Sorry about that. Um, she had that cone head going on. So since I've had her for a while, she's had an opportunity to sit on the mannequin head inside out. I sprayed the cap with a little bit of oil sheen to let that go down. And it has gone down a lot. So it, has, it doesn't really even have that um, cone head anymore. She's very pretty. My allergies are bothering me, ladies, so please forgive me for that, you know, uh, doing all that sniffing and stuff. So it's really not bad. And like I said, Harlem Collection, I'm going to turn around so you guys can see the back. Not bad. Now, I think to add a little bit of volume in her... I have my Coriolis flat iron. I'm going to take and put some curls in her and I'll be right back. Okay guys, I'm back and she is all curled up and this is the finished look and I am loving it, loving it, loving it, loving it. Chloe is a keeper. I really like this wig. This is going to be really good for the summertime so I'm going to turn around and let you guys Take it back. And I love, love, love the back hairline and everything. It's very pretty. I love the streaks in it and the whole nine yards. The sideburns, all of it is so beautiful. So once again, this is Chloe with the EK on the end. I don't know, you know, how they're really pronouncing it. I'm just going to say Chloe. And this is a F1B30. And she is 100% human hair and I found her on Hair Sisters for $20.49 so if you're interested and you really like this wig go check it out and pick her up and um, all I did was use my Coriolis um, 
flat iron, which I got from Apex Hairs. I believe I paid $60 for it. It's a little pricey, but it is really worth it. Um, I love my Coriolis flat iron. It does wonders. Um, I believe that I have it set on, I can't really see these numbers, but I think I want to see that, say that it's probably like at 250. I didn't have it on a high heat because the hair is short and you don't really need a lot. You just need to bump it and go. So thanks so God, thanks guys for um, getting tongue tied today because I am so exhausted. But anyway, thanks so much for tuning in to my channel today and stay tuned for more videos. Love you guys. Love you guys.